With New Year's Day comes college football games. Now, if you aren't a fan of college football, that's okay, because hopefully you're a fan of Jewish people. This season, there are a number of Jewish college football players playing bowl games. I've done some research, and I've found a quite a few menches in the trenches. For the Outback Bowl, played on New Year's Day, check out Florida's offensive tackle, Matt Patchen. This 6-foot, 7-inch beast of a man boasts a 3.4 GPA and also keeps kosher. In the Valero Alamo Bowl, Arizona's Jake Barrett is an offensive lineman. Paired with fellow Wildcat Adam Gottschalk, the two show why my friends call it Juson, not Tucson. For Syracuse in the New Era Pinstripe Bowl, Ryan Lichtenstein is backed up by freshman Ross Krautman as place kickers. If they had to play football, it seems as if their mothers made sure they played the one position without any contact. In the Sugar Bowl, set to play on January 4th, Make sure you catch Justin and older brother Zach Boren, known as the Bash Brothers of Ohio State. Justin has been named to the Jewish Sports Review's All-American team, and Zach is well on his way. But undoubtedly the most well-known Jewish college football player this bowl season is Gabe Karimi. Gabe is a left tackle from Wisconsin that is considered one of the top prospects for the upcoming NFL draft. The Rose Bowl happens to fall on the Sabbath, but don't worry. Gabe is an active member of his local synagogue. In order to celebrate Yom Kippur this year, Karimi started fasting early so he would be able to recover in time for the game. Alright, so he's not exactly Sandy Koufax, but he's trying. Well, I hope this makes your college bowl experience a little more exciting. Next time, maybe I'll tell you how to win your fantasy league while only choosing Jewish football players. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding.